the news in depth. Today, let's talk about Fatima's job. An advert commissioned by the UK government depicted a ballerina tying her shoes. The tasteful caption was, Fatima's next job could be a cyber. In brackets, she just doesn't know it yet. Rethink, reskill, reboot. Her Majesty's government. Although the ad only stayed on a few days before being taken down after an outcry across the country from the arts sector, it inspired a huge amount of creativity. It started with simple restructuring of the ad, such as Fatima's job is creative. She knows it and keeps going. Adapt, collaborate, innovate. Then it proceeded with a little less factual, simple editions of bunch of absolute bellends after Her Majesty's government. A slightly harsher version where the words are just a little changed is Fatima's not fucking retraining. This isn't her hobby, it's her calling. Essentially, the government screwed up with getting rid of high quality IT through the idiotic idea of Brexit profiting the country and uh, thought it would be a brilliant idea to tell people in the arts to give up and retrain themselves as cyber. But what kind of cyber they did not really specify. Someone observant realized it took a huge bunch of creative people to make this ad where they are telling creative people to give up. Interestingly, the original image was from a US photographer based in Atlanta, Georgia, and the dancer's name was certainly not Fatima. There were some lovely appropriate images that followed, such as this one of Picasso, Mozart, and of course, William Shakespeare, whose next job may be in an Amazon warehouse. Of course, next victims were, quite rightly, the UK politicians. Rishi Sunak, in charge of the Treasury, whose next job could be at Wagamame. Dominic Cummings, Boris Johnson's chief advisor, whose next job could be in prison laundry. And Boris Johnson himself, whose next job could be in either refrigeration or in something he can actually do because there must be something. Or even in politics because no one knows what the fuck he's doing now. Of course, there had to be one of Oliver Dowden, the secretary of digital culture, media and sport. Like it's a really great idea to put those things together since they are so similar. His next job could obviously be a chocolate teapot, which incidentally is a British expression meaning fucking useless. Essentially, people think that Fatima could keep the job she loves if the government decided to give a fuck. Or at least Fatima's next job could be kicking Tory heads from their fucking shoulders with her grand jeté. But why not turn things around? Because Keith's next job could be in ballet. He just doesn't know it yet. The internet continues to come up with creative suggestions for the UK government on how they can continue crushing young people's dreams in the future. So watch out, boys and girls. Put down the paintbrush. We are thinking junior accountant at best. Johnny here thinks he's going to be the next Tony Hawk. I hope you like cleaning up shit, Johnny, because we are thinking sanitation. Not everyone can be an astronaut, Jenny. Have you even thought about a career in proctology? Get to learning spreadsheet, little Timmy. You aren't Mark fucking Twain. If you subscribe to my channel, then the world will be a better place. Well, not really, but it will help me. So please subscribe. <laughs>